I have come to edify you with the revelation on the 18th of January 2020 so, it was at 9am and we were leaving the church as night vigil ended, we were talking about things to do and not to do during fasting, and what attitude to adopt, it was then the Lord gave a vision, where I saw a multitude of angels assembled and receiving instruction from the Lord, they were numerous and they were holding work instrument on their hand, that reflected their task and respective mission on the earth and the heaven, some were holding notebooks and others were holding construction tools, others were holding vase containing pure living water, others were holding vase containing anointing oil, others were holding pack containing gift, in parallel, when I looked down to the earth, I saw a similar scene that was happening in hell, I saw a gathering of fallen angel and demon that were receiving instruction from the queen of the coast, she was dressed with a silk robe that was transparent, it had crack that went from the foot to the hip exposing the red string she was wearing, her robe was sleeveless exposing her breast and armpit, she had English style of hair that was shining, she was about to deploy demon on earth for the end time battle. I saw that these demon had tools of distraction on their hand, they had had bag of cursed money, they have bag of fashion and indecent clothes, others had bag of shoes, others were holding vase of liquid poison, which was the venom of the serpent, I saw a demon that stood apart, he was dressed like a posh and rich man, his appearance seems extremely posh, his particularity was that his tool of destruction was his tongue, he had a false gospel in his mouth and strong power of persuasion, he was calm and impulsive, he only spoke lies and cursed when he opened his mouth, other demon were agitated but he was serene, the queen of the coast told them, you must hurry and descend to the earth's surface, you must rush and be quick, you know that our time is finished, the just man is coming to judge the world, he must find us ruining and destroying his workmanship, we must stop these Christian from being rapture, this bunch of rat must not rise with him we will stop them from flying with him, we will stop them from living in the celestial region where we were cast out, none of these souls that are your target should escape, they must suffer and should not escape capture, woe to you if you lose one of them, these weapon in your possession are dreadful against them, none of these people should escape I repeat none of them should escape, you have a deadline and you must succeed before the deadline. After delivering this war speech I saw the great invasion of demon on the earth, brother it was really massive conquest and movement of troop, at the same time, when I look at the second heaven, I saw wicked spirit in the heavenly, the were giants humanoid demon, they were robust and had head of animals, each of them was holding a bow and they were charging arrows, they began to shoot continually arrows to men and women on the earth, these demon hid behind the earth atmosphere. In the third heaven I saw angels receiving instruction from the Lord for the end time, they deployed to the earth in an organized way, each one was coming down to earth with his work instrument, when they had reached the earth each one took action in the lives of the saint, Christian that were working on their behavior in order to resemble Jesus Christ have received angels that were holding notebook. These angels wrote the next step for them. This written testimony became their nature over time, the saint that had spiritual weakness and always sight of the Holy Spirit, receive angel that had a vase of oil, the Lord angels poured holy oil on them, as a result they receive renaissance and they were anew again, the saint that were dry, receive the visit of the angel that have pure and crystalline water in the vase, which was poor in their lives, I saw an angel that was proclaiming the good news of the gospel. I saw a woman that have received a sparkling light and was able to hear the message of the Lord Angel, her bondage were broken, her tore garment was replaced by a garment of the purest white, and she was shining, I saw that the lady was no more on the land because she was taken to the air, all the saints that were changed as a result of angelic ministration were taken to the air, I saw in the sky myriads of saints of all nations and language where they were received by the Lord who was coming down with millions of angels in the air to receive the saints that were transformed, for the Lord himself will descend from heaven with a loud command, with the voice of an archangel, and with the trumpet of God, and the dead in Christ will be the first to rise. After that, we who are alive and remain will be caught up together with them in the clouds to meet the Lord in the air. 
and so we will always be with the Lord, they met in a crossroad in the air and the Lord began to lead the saint to the celestial world of light, as the Lord led the saints in the air to the eternal gate of the holy city, I saw the fallen, the dwellers of the second heaven, the wicked spirit of the heavenly places, they were falling to the earth like stars and the meteorite, it is written the stars will fall from the sky, and the powers of the heavens will be shaken, finally the Lord took the glorified saint to the ancient gate, and he closed the pearly gate of the third heaven, while stars were falling from the sky, there was chaos in space and on the earth, I saw demons that looked like reptile, dinosaurs and dragon, I saw humanoid demon riding out these reptiles and dinosaurs, that were descending and entering the earth atmosphere and the material world, when these reptiles, dinosaurs and dragon landed on the earth surface, they were so huge that they trample and crush people as if people were flower, to my surprise people that were trampled and crushed by these dinosaurs and reptile were not dying, they were able to rise again, they were filled with pain, it is written people will seek death and death will flee, dreadful demon were leaving the unseen world and manifesting in the physical world, people saw monsters, dragon and demons that they could not even suspect the existence, they caused torment to the dweller of the earth, when people saw this disaster they cried to God and repented, as a result, they cause rage in the heart of these beasts that fell from the heavens, I saw Satan in a concentration camp ordering demon to torment Christian that were opposing him, there was one thing happening worldwide which is the marking of the global population with the mark of the Antichrist, any man that resisted the mark of the beast was captured and led to the torture camps. These camps were like long building confiscated for sequestration of dissident of the mark of the beast. There was unbearable smells and I saw torture instrument. I saw that there were less women for the majority were adult men from 20 to 60. In truth women were accepting the mark of the Antichrist quickly they could not bear the treatment inflicted on dissident. I saw a woman that received the mark of the Antichrist she had a four years old child that had missed the rapture, the child was crying while looking at her mother, I saw in the child eyes that she was unhappy that her mother took the mark of the beast, the mother told the child unless you take the mark like me I will not take care of you, you have no one else except me, we are all left behind, there is no more hope for us, at least we can live and enjoy a life of luxury like everybody that took the mark poverty is finished for all of us that took, the child cry but she had nowhere to go and the mother got the child to receive the mark, I noticed that as soon as a person was marked he was dispossessed of his humanity and became heartless and cold blooded and wicked, I also realized that there was no more vision and revelation and people that got vision and revelation they got it from the enemy, because the Lord had closed the third heaven, there was no more connection between the heaven and the earth, Whatever happened in temples on the land was for the glory of Satan, the joy that were in people face in the great tribulation was only apparent it was not complete and did not come from the inside, there was false love on the land people lived with psychoses and fear resulting from the return of the Lord, for there were still people resisting the beast and people suspected that the Lord would come again to get them, the people that were marked lived in harmony with demon, and life on the earth was a life of ice and sexual perversion people knew that they had nothing to lose, they live a life vice in the extreme, since people accepted the mark of the beast they went on to live a life rebellions, a life independent from God, people knew that they have rejected God by accepting the beast and that they will suffer judgment and punishment when the Lord come, those who oppose the beast were undergoing unbearable torment they wonder and said Lord for how long this will last, this was intense torment. They fought to keep their salvation with their own strength, brother I beg you if the Lord said that time is finished let us wake up and watch and pray, let's hang on to the Lord, things that I saw after the rapture were unbearable, let us accelerate things and let do things in the maximum, the Lord is warning his bride to avoid the post-rapture period because of the torment that is unbearable.